on the surface, it sounds like you work 23 and a half hours a day, seven <laughs> days a week, 52 weeks a year. But really, what, what was the reality? <laughs> the reality at the time, the point where I jumped into, and this was interesting. So I have a mentor coach and I called him because he's hard. He is hardcore. And uh, he's my, my New York, deep New York guy. And, and he says, um, look, I said, I did $850,000 this year. You know, he goes, good, do a million. I was like, are you kidding me? I was like, I really wanted to cut back. I, you know, we were, we were going to have a child and I didn't want to be in the salon around the clock and around the clock all the time. And so that was when I took it seriously. And I was like, I'm going to start working four days a week. And I'm no longer going to work 13 and 14 hours a day. We don't take breaks inside our industry. And so it's just this grind on your body. And I was like, how do I do this? So I did the math. I was like, if I hire one more set of hands, if I hire one more set of hands, that can help me shampoo, blow dry, or apply a color. Um, then now I'm working like a dentist or an attorney. You know, they have paralegals, they have hygienists. Yes. You go to a doctor, they have PA. So I have to look at my industry through other people's eyes. I have to look through how the other successful industries have done it. And so when I did that, what I found was I could work less, earn more. So I was creating, I still don't necessarily believe in work-life balance. I haven't found that yet because when I, when I start working the additional day in the salon, another career started to develop there that was bigger.